You know, one of the things I was uh, reading, and as a parent, I've got four kids, they've grown up healthy, never had an issue, you know, sickness, well, little sicknesses mm. along the way, but nothing serious. Now, we heard from Michael Thiessen, his uh, youngest son, uh, Gabriel, had cancer. Yeah. And we thank the Lord that he was healed of that, and he's doing great. But many parents are dealing with... You know, having a child die suddenly, mm -hmm. it's, it's a horrible thing. Oh, I, can only, I, I could not imagine yeah, what it's, that's like. So, and because they, in the U.S., I don't, and it's, you know, they're trying to figure some of these statistics out, but there's more than six children per 1,000 that die, wow. you know, as a result of the sudden baby syndrome, yes, sudden death syndrome. Yep. Yeah, and it's a terrible thing. But in New Jersey, they're taking steps to it because they're following in Finland's uh, footsteps for over 80 years. They've had these baby boxes. Mm. And so there's going to be 105,000 of these baby boxes in New Jersey. Go home with parents. They just have to register online. And what and is a baby box? Well, there it is on the screen, and okay. they, you know, they'll send uh, some things along with it, including package. diapers, onesies, baby wipes, and some other things. And then it's the box. It acts as a bed. Wow. And as you see, they're, they're upright, and they're in a more secured situation. Mm. Now, unfortunately, parents who love their children, they will sometimes take the baby into bed, especially if it's in the middle of the night. Yes. You've been there. You know what that's yeah. like. Yeah. And unfortunately, sometimes accidents happen. Yeah. So this is in lieu, or, or I guess instead of a crib, you would use this box. At least at, at the beginning, yeah. At the beginning. And to kind of, you're right, like especially in beds as well to put your baby in there. You know, I, uh, I, I don't know if you know, but I run a charity called the Baby Depot. Mm -hmm. And we collect gently used baby clothing and we give uh, a year's worth of clothing to babies in need. In Hamilton and so kind of a care package times a million for yeah. with, with that but we go into a lot of homes where they don't have a crib and they're begging us if we have one or something so I could only imagine how just getting one of those boxes and they're free it seems like yeah they register online and they actually take a little course wow. and then you know so they know exactly what they're to do with it and the good news Maggie is it's coming to Canada in May oh. So for you watching out there, and if you know somebody that maybe can't afford a crib, I mean, that, to me, that's something that, you know, we absolutely need to do. But this baby box is kind of that, you know, when you bring the little, yeah. little one home and then get them, you know, kind of oh. properly sleeping and not having an accident that would devastate your life. And not having to worry about it. Not, yeah. You know, just having that peace of mind knowing that your child is safe. Mm -hmm. Very, very important.